we had a few uh, last minute arrivals yesterday and we're just getting them out this morning just to sort of process them really. Uh, one of them being this lovely Lotus, which you, Jacko, have fallen in love with. And I do this, I, you know, I, I, yeah, I do this. I was gonna say that there's, there's cars that come in and I, which I normally wouldn't go for, but then Jack just had a little trip up the industrial estate in this Lotus yesterday without any prompting, came back and said, do you know what, Dad? We've had loads of these, haven't we? And I've yet to drive one that I would actually like and buy. And he said, but I've just driven this one and it's mint. Yeah. It's a strange old job, isn't it? Because I often say this to people with MGBs. I mean, you know as well as with I, Jack, we have hundreds of MGBs every season, every year. But there's the odd one every now and again that drives head and shoulders above the arrest. And it's not normally the one you think it's gonna be. It's normally the scruffy one, yeah, it's normally the rubber bumper, unrestored, okay, but you think, and then you get in a fully restored early pull handle car that's had thousands spent, and it drives bloody awful. Anyway, but um, I haven't had a chance to go around this car. We just started the video straight off the, off the cuff as we do. We don't prep anything, we just go for it. But, uh, but you like it, don't you? I do like it, yeah. I've actually yet to drive a nice one. I never have. I went down the industrial state yesterday. I don't know, I got in it. You just get a feel straight yeah, away, don't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't even drive it. Uh, I didn't even look at the mileage either. Um, I just went down, I thought, you know what, that actually feels quite nice. I just go down the road with it. Then you went again, did you? And uh, <laughs> yeah, I went again. And we went home. And uh, I thought, you know what, it's the first one. I can actually think, no, I can take that. I know. Yeah. And I, 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 I'm the same. I, I, you know, we're lucky enough to drive all sorts. And you look at something, and then you drive it, and you think there's no way I could work all week and look forward to going out in that on a Sunday because it would spoil me day. But that's the opposite. Yeah. It just feels right. Yeah. 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 It looks the business, it does look ever so straight. It looks like it's gonna drive well. The red one, the red Lotus that the Bangers team restored with the guys down country, I can't think, I wish I could think of the company's name, Lotus down, way down country somewhere. They done a really good job. But, but that was a very, very good car to start with. Um, they improved on it, that drove lovely. Do you know, I thought that drove lovely. I haven't got time to drive them all, mate. I'd love to go and drive them all. Incidentally, guys, we don't drive around in people's cars. We maybe just go for a little drundle up to the industrial state and back, um, but we are super respectful when it comes to people's cars. And we have some lovely uh, customers stroke friends, you know, and then they come along and they say, go home in it, take it home, go home. And I'm like, oh, I'd love to, but no, I don't, no, nah. no, 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 don't do it. But anyhow, this has got the makings of a proper car. Um, Jack obviously drives probably more than I do nowadays, more cars than I do. Um, so when he says it's right, it will be right. So I assume that's gravel rash and not splashes yet. So you're gonna paint the front bumper, aren't you, at some point? Sooner rather than later, I would think, because that's your sort of focal point of the car. Jack's gonna carry on and do some photographs in a minute. We're just gonna pull it outside in some better light. I can, oh Jack, we open the back end there. We'll just have a quick look. We'll just have a quick look in there. What is it showing on the speedo? 8,270, that's the reading today. I can't remember the oranges in the background to it. I really can't. All I do know is there's very little wear on that gear knob, there's very little wear on this steering wheel, there's very little wear on those pad up rubbers. There's a little bit of wear on the seat, but that bolster gets it every time you get in and out. So there's absolute minimal wear. It's only the second one I've seen where the struts actually work. Oh yeah, that's working as well. Yeah. Yeah. I can remember when we first got one in, a, you know, that we owned as a family back, at, back in the day, back over at Reddington, when I would be your age. And I remember going home in it then thinking, hmm, you know, but like I say, every now and again, one comes along that just ticks the boxes. Anyhow, you guys come down and have a look. Jack will, Jack will sell you it, because he's in love with it. Come down, 
No, it's horrible, don't buy it. So yeah, come down and have a look. Jack's gonna do a nice series of photographs now. Um, the idea of the videos, obviously, is that it's just to give you guys another feel for it. But look at that. Not a lot wrong with that, guys, as far as I can see.